Hey designers and welcome back. I have been to the Dollar Tree and have some super fun things to show you, so stick around. Welcome back you guys and a huge welcome to those of you that are new here to Divine Design. Yeah, we've been shopping again to one of our favorite stores and I have some really fun things in this haul. Can't wait to show you. No, I didn't take you into the store with me this time like I did last week because this was kind of an impromptu little shopping spree. Found some good things that I wasn't expecting to see. So I'm going to turn the camera around and show you that way because most of these items are so small you're not going to be able to see them any other way. But before we do, I've got to say a huge thank you to my very special anonymous friend. I still don't know who you are, but while we were out, we stopped in by the post office, got your very special gift, and thank you so much. Thank you for the beautiful letter. Your words were so kind, so sweet, and so supportive, and I just cannot thank you enough. And in your letter, you said go to the Dollar Tree, so that's exactly what we did. And I'm gonna show you what we got. So let's turn this camera around and get started. First up, you guys, with some of the e.l.f. products. I was very happy to come across these because I haven't seen any of these in a store near me yet. I did pick up one of the lip glosses. These are supposed to have just a little bit of a tint to them, but more of a gloss, not necessarily a full coverage lip color, but we're going to be testing these out together. So be looking for a swatch video. This is the extra lip glosses, and I thought it was kind of curious because they're all named after ex-boyfriends. This one is called Brett. Also found one of the e.l.f. lip lacquers. Now these are supposed to be just a little bit thicker and a lot more pigmented when you put these on. So again, we will see together. This one is called Bold Pink. I did find one of the e.l.f. little crayons. These are the lip crayons and this is supposed to have a glossy texture and also again, I believe this is a little bit thinner of a formula and not necessarily some bold rich colors. This one is called Summer Nights. I was also able to find one of the lip kiss balms. So we're going to try this one out for you. These are also slightly pigmented, but it is a balm that's supposed to give a little bit moisture to the lips. This one is called Very Sweet. And I was also able to find another one of the lip crayons. These are the matte crayons and I have used these before in some different colors and love them. They are a good texture on these crayons. This one here is called Mulberry Maven. Also found this super adorable little quad from LA Colors. Check out those bold colors. Two neutrals in there as well. This is a shadow by number. So it has written out for you here a little formula, a little tutorial, so to speak, on how you can apply these colors to achieve an eye look. So again, be looking for a video. We'll be testing these out together. This one here is in Foxy Formulas. One of the things that was new to my store that I have not seen anywhere yet was this little matte quad from LA Colors. That's right, all matte shades, which I love with my older skin. Absolutely gorgeous. This one is in Matte and Efficient, and they had four different color schemes. Let's take a look at all of them. This next one is a neutral palette, and you can tell that is a cool toned neutral palette loving these colors because I am a cool toned girl. So excited to try this one. This one is called Matterific. They also had this neutral palette. You can tell this is a warmer neutral palette and you can tell the difference looking at these side by side. This one is a lot more cool toned. This one is warmer tone. This one is called Mattifying. And then check out this bold one, you guys. Haha, <laughs> definitely excited to try this one with that beautiful blue in there. This one is called Matte Arama. Like I said, these were the only four palettes that I was able to find. Not sure if there are more than the four or not, but these were the four that I found. You can kind of look at the packaging to get an idea of the color scheme that it's going for, but was definitely excited to find these. And again, I will be doing a video review for you. My store also had in these little e.l.f. brushes. This is an angled foundation brush. Don't intend to use this for foundation, but I'm going to be glad to have this in my collection nonetheless. So definitely a great buy for just a dollar. 
my store had in some new wet and wild brushes as well you guys will remember that we had purchased the wet and wild about a year ago maybe a little longer now and now they're back but they have some different shapes to them so i was definitely excited this one here is the large concealer brush i also found a smoky liner brush picked up two of the small eyeshadow brushes love these because they're nice and flat for a great application on the eyelid and this one here is not new we were able to pick these up the last time that wet n wild came around this is the angled liner brush and i love the tip of this brush nice and small and tight enough to get the perfect little line right there on those eyelashes if you want to get real close to the base of those so definitely be looking for one of these i was super excited to find some of the impress nails that many of you guys have been hauling they look so adorable and right now i can definitely use them because my nails are in horrible shape we've been cleaning up after a hurricane so <laughs> now is a great time to try them pick some up for me and baby girl each one of these has 30 nails and then some of them have accent nails inside this particular one has two different accent nails you can see those in there but really loving this color for fall all right finally find the name for you guys this one is called night fever this one is called bells and whistles and it is a beautiful matte blue a deep deep navy blue with a gold accent this one is called shake it up this is a shiny blue and again it is a midnight blue but very very pretty texture on that this is gradiated on some of these accents with a silver glitter tip and then there are some full glitter nail accents as well these right here are called one shine day these are white nails with a glitter tip Tip on them and then it does have some silver glitter accent nails this one is called boogie down and look how beautiful that matte burgundy is with that gold glitter accent yes definitely can't wait to try these beautiful for this time of year this fun and whimsical one is called flash mob it is a matte black super cute and look at those polka dots very very fun and then these here are called harlem shake and it is a gradiated nail with some burgundy up to a more neutral pink color and then it does have those same color accents in a polka dot for the accent nails super cute not sure how many of the impress nail patterns there are these were the seven that we could find and they are all very cute so be looking for a video coming soon i'm going to apply these with you on camera and let you know what i think about them this is a repurchase some of the elf shiny eraser blotting sheets you get 50 sheets in here for just a dollar i was in desperate need for some new little claws so i picked up this 12 pack for a dollar baby girl was super excited to find this microfiber bandeau this is very very nice for keeping that hair out of your face when you're washing your face or applying your makeup different things like that super comfortable and stretchy and just quite nice i do have a fall themed diy coming up for you guys here soon so i picked up two packages of the fall leaves check out these beautiful placemats you guys you probably aren't going to be able to tell the size the way i have this camera just a regular size of a placemat they are cloth so i believe you should be able to wash these with no problem the other side is a beautiful orange color I don't believe this is meant to be reversible because you can kind of see through that to the seam but you probably could get away with using it reversibly if you wanted to but these were absolutely adorable for that fall table and will go perfectly with those new dishes that you saw me haul the other day another repurchase that we get quite often at Dollar Tree are the rubber gloves for all that house cleaning and obviously yes I had to get pink and there you have it yeah some really fun things can't wait to try those nails I'll do them with you on a video and we'll see how they work together how about that and keep watching because I'm also going to show you guys some videos using these makeup products mm -hmm. yeah and I'm super excited about that we'll swatch all those lipsticks and we'll do a few eye looks to see how these eyeshadows are going to apply and how they're going to wear sound like a plan yeah it does to me too so keep watching you never know when things like that are going to pop up. And again, I want to thank my very special friend. You just bless me so much, not only with the gifts that you send, but you bless me just with your words and the encouragement and positivity. And I just, I cannot say thank you enough. My heart is overwhelmed. Yes, it is. And I pray that God just richly bless you in return because even though I don't know who you are, 
He certainly does. So a huge, huge thank you to you. And a big thank you to all the rest of you for taking time to watch and spend a few minutes with me today. I want to remind you guys that you were created for purpose. So get out there and be all you can be. I'll see you soon in the next video.